Everybody, welcome to Epic Bro. I'm Tom. Today I'm taking out my Executioner Sword build. That's the build right there. 332 armor, Executioner Sword, Fireproof, Fury. Uh, it's standard, standard build, really. Nothing too fancy going on there. But today I'm going to play in third person. You activate third person perspective by hitting P on your keyboard. If you're playing with the controller, I can't help you. And also Y. <laughs> and you can turn on team markers by hitting H, by the way. A couple people have been asking how I've been doing that. And we're going to swap back into third person here. As soon as this guy goes away. There we go. Okay, we're back. <laughs> so there's a couple main benefits. And I'd say disadvantages of playing in third person. And I'm going to try to go through them and play at the same time. The first being, you can really get a better idea of what's going on around you in third person. And you can have better swing control because you can see your targets better as opposed to being locked, staring kind of like at them. This way you can see around them and angle your swings a bit better. Did you get that guy in there? I'm not really sure. I know there was, I know there was a second maybe. Okay, that's a friendly flag. I know my colors, all right. I know the differences. Okay, that guy's toast. I feel like this might be a short round. But we'll see. A disadvantage, though, of playing in third person is it can be hard to kind of tell what your enemy is doing if they get up in your face because your player model kind of gets in the way, especially depending on how big you are. Like, my guy's pretty big. If I was using tank, I'd see even less. And if they're, like, doing the thing where they get in front of you and they crash down to get the... The cheesy XL. <laughs> it's gonna be even tougher. Oh no, did I accidentally... Oh, did he... Okay, good. He rolled the right way, I think. I thought... <laughs> I thought he jumped on me, and then rolled off me, and then fell off the castle. I was afraid I just accidentally murdered a teammate. But it didn't appear to be the case. We got a happy mill in here. I forgot how I even took damage. We're just going to run down here and start fighting because they're not really fighting on the castle at all. He's going to turn around and swing. No, he just ran away. He just ran away. There we go. Oh, no, he came back. <laughs> I thought he was gone for good. He must have just been running out to get ammo or something. Because sometimes people will run away and then they'll they'll turn and get you. But he just kept going. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he ducked. I'm not going to let somebody run away and kill me in the back now. You got two in hot pursuit. He chose a, a magnificent view to die upon. <laughs> Let's do it. Go down here. Take a little damage, but there's a happy meal. So it's okay. We're back in business. What's this guy doing? He's going for the archer. Got him in the legs. Oh, that was the wrong one. There we go. Let's get the Maw Boy. Got him with the drag. Oh, I got sliced in half. Was I that low? I didn't even realize I was that low. I guess I was. We got three minutes <laughs> added to the clock. I'll probably play part of the next round too because this is going to be short like I thought it would be. And that's okay. Back in the old days, I used to stick to just one match of video. But then a lot of the times I'd have to wait for a round to end. And then by the time the round started, I was tired of playing. Uh oh, he got me. Okay. I didn't expect that to work. Baby Archer, you had your high heels on. No? The parry couldn't catch that? Mordhau, please. 
That was a pretty... That was a pretty on-point parry. Mordhau gives, Mordhau takes. And it's important to remember both. There we go. Is the guy on the roof? No, the guy's not on the roof. I think he died over there. I don't really see blue team pushing the wagon from there to there in two and a half minutes. I just don't see it happening. I was afraid that guy was going to die. Look at this. <laughs> this noble attempt here. There we go. We got him. It wasn't a fair fight. <laughs> let's, let's let me know. Okay, let's make this a bit of a fair fight. Okay. Oh, that didn't connect. Okay. Did I jump over that guy's hit? He sounds sleepy. I'm coming, my dude. Oh, the mall in the back. <laughs> what can you do about it? Besides have eyes in the back of your head. Oh, this was not where I expected this to be, but okay. We're here. No, no connection. I think he's going out anyway. He's using my sword. What? <laughs> I can't believe that connected too. Let's get back out there. Oh, sorry, little guy. I'm getting one shot here. What's happening? Blue team just can't get out of this castle. They're about halfway down the road, though. They got 30 seconds. But I just don't see it happening. There we go. Sometimes a good use of feint is to try to time your attacks and spread the cadence of uh, impacts. I missed that. You're going to get him, little Pan Man? Oh, I guess not. He didn't come in and attack me. Oh, we got it. We got it. Executioner sword is pretty slow too. How did that happen? Did you guys see that? Get out of the way, scoreboard. How did that even happen? I can't check the Can't check it anymore. Are we going oh we're going to Castello? So it's gonna be a 45 minute massacre. <laughs> I'll play a bunch of it. I won't I probably won't play the full map, but take a little coffee break here in between rounds but yeah the the differences between third person and first person it's obviously going to be a preference thing i prefer to play mordhau in first person and then i prefer to play chivalry too in third person just because the gameplay is different and i feel like you have more to benefit from playing mordhau in first person than in third person and vice versa for shiv too just because you have to kind of mirror. What you do in Chivalry 2 is you chamber a lot. You want to chamber a lot. And it's easier to do that in third person. Because you can see the whole enemy player model. No matter if you're like looking right at him or if they're off to the side. Like if you see a guy on your right, he's doing an overhead, you can quickly pivot. But if I'm like, if I'm doing this, I have no idea what that guy right over here is doing. But in first person, I can see that, that white flower bush, even though I'm can't see it in first person. That's kind of the gimmick there. No? He got him. That's the flute man. We're going to leave the flute man alone. Bring it around on the big guy. There we go. Okay, but okay. Easy there. Easy there. Oh, <laughs> that could have been my head. That could have been my head. Yeah. 
No? I'm constantly misjudging the range on this, huh? Oh, no. I didn't see it. There were so many bodies. <laughs> Castella's always a mess. He didn't panic parry, but he died for it. Buddy, get out of the way. I couldn't move. I couldn't move. I guess he wasn't playing in third person. <laughs> this guy's just desperate for a friend. He's waving at anybody who will wave back. Hello? Whoa, watch out there. No? Okay. It's always chaos. It's always just absolute chaos here. I kind of love it. I kind of don't. But it is what it is. Feels like we're getting some momentum, but I don't think we should push too far up because there spawns right there. I'm really glad that was friendly. Let's go around here. Where's this guy going? What are these fellas doing? There used to be cannons up here. I don't know where they went. Red team stole them. Let's help this guy out. Kick him out the wall. <laughs> That's always satisfying. Was it? I think it was the video I posted yesterday. I died up against... Oh, yeah. It was yesterday's video when I was in the... I don't know if it's a chicken coop or a pig pen or whatever. But the door was closed behind me and I was fighting a mall guy. <laughs> so I couldn't turn around to open it without giving him a free hit, which is all they need. And so I died with my back up against a little half door. And then they killed me and I flipped over. <laughs> and so those are always the best. this guy going come on buddy I gave my position away let's go oh hey oh no that didn't connect that didn't connect okay Man, I don't know where these swings are going sometimes. It feels like I should be landing a couple of them, but I'm not. Man, they keep building these things. These flags. I'm walking off the HP burn here. Okay, they got the flag. They're trying. You gotta, you gotta give it to them. There we go. He's behind me? Oh, hello. Oh, come on. Man. Where are some of these attacks going? There we go. That guy had an arrow right in his throat. God bless. Okay, he's done. He's done. I'm going to check the flanks for flags. Nobody wants... <laughs> What's going on over here? Are they building up a box in the arena? You good? Okay. I'm just seeing what's happening. That would have been way cool if I landed that. <laughs> Not much you can do against somebody who knows how to use a master when you have a slow weapon. Besides, like, whittle down their stamina, that's about it. That guy was in way too deep. There we 
we go. Get the free hits in. Get the free hits in. Oh, my teammate blocked that. That stinks. That stinks. If I would have brought it around from the other side, I think he would have hit me first. So it's kind of what you got to play. We got arrows zipping, flying by. We got boys low having happy meals. Oh my goodness. Good night, sweet prince. <laughs> Let's get some of these archers. Throw some stuff back at them. We're doing all right, though. We're doing all right. We got eight minutes to hold them here. All it takes is one good push. I'm still worried about them coming around the side over here. But it doesn't appear that my worries are uh, necessary. I don't know what was going on there. See, sometimes I don't understand parries. Like, that guy parried attacks from two different... Was this yours? Here, there you go. That guy attacked... Or parried attacks from two different sides. And then earlier, my parry couldn't catch the... The cleaver that was coming in on me from... 2 o'clock. <laughs> Pay attention. Gonna back up here. That guy thought I was red. I could see it in his eyes. Look at that chicken nuggets. Saving the day. Who put that there? Come on. Can do better than that. Give me something to throw. That's a messer. Here we go. That's all I need. Let's see how good my aim is in third person. Okay, way too high. Let's try that again. Look at that. Poor guy. No? Like, where was that parrot? <laughs> we good? We good. Have some more chicken nuggets here. I'm loving it. There you go. Right in the thigh. Let's try that again. Oh, okay. Let's not. <laughs> Oh, that was the cleanest decap I think I've ever seen. Uh oh. Oh, it's okay. It happens. I've done it many times. As Reinhardt says, forgive and forget. <laughs> Crossing over my games these days. I still play Overwatch too. I just don't put it on the channel. I play Overwatch too probably more than I play Mordhau. It's more satisfying for me to do good in that game than it is in this game. I just have a lot of fun in this game. No. Oh, he just smacked his teammate in the face. Oh, poor guy. Somehow I have a throwing axe. I don't remember picking that up. Should let my health come back. They got about four minutes left here. Whoa, watch out, fellas. We have the stair vantage down here. There we go. Teamwork. Teamwork. I feel like I'm going to accidentally back up into these spikes one of these times. There you go. You can use those, by the way, and still keep moving. You just pivot around them. It makes it a bit harder for like, an enemy archer to hit you while you're just standing there. So you're not just like showing them your butt while you're healing.
I got somebody, uh, I was in a bad spot. That was all me. Definitely in this early part of Castello, faster weapons are the best option, I think. Because big slow weapons like the Executioner Sword or the Zweihander are good in maps like Camp and the open parts of Fatoria. Because you can just like target swap. And I guess even Arid, because Arid is pretty wide open. You just want to target swap, hit the enemy in the back, and move on to somebody else. But in this, you want to be able to kind of keep up with multiple people at once. So, I mean, you can totally make it happen, but it'll be easier using a, a quicker, shorter weapon. We are way too far up here, but it's working for us. Into the spawn. Look at that. There's pretty much no way I could have missed the throw there. What's going on up here? What is this? A bow? How's my aim in third person? Let's find out. The reticle is different. It like sways way up. He's out. I don't know where those I don't know where those shots were going. Let's help this guy. Let's help him out and I immediately hit him in the back. Okay. I guess that guy thought his teammate was going to get me. <laughs> oh, I'm hit. Oh, man. That guy's definitely hit. Everybody get a happy meal. Everybody get a happy meal. This guy's going for the archers. What's happening? Oh, he's going for nothing. I don't think they're going to get it. I thought this was going to be a much longer round than it has been. He's going to build a flag up there. You got to hide the flag at least, bud. People are going to spawn in and get stuck there. <laughs> I'm just kind of screening for anybody getting past my front line, but everybody's doing a good job. Red team's probably not having a great time. Where's he going? He's AFK, man. Could have been me. There we go. Two for one. Any happy meals? Do I gotta? Yeah, here's. Oh no. I was murdered. So close to salvation. It's like a movie. If it was a movie, that archer would have picked it up and like thrown it at me and I would have been reaching out for it in slow motion and then the arrow would have pierced my heart. What is this guy doing? <laughs> I mean, I don't know what he was doing. I think he's clearly given up. If that guy up there was smart, he'd pop out this window and nail those guys. I have 20 seconds. There's no way I can get up there to do it. And there's no way they're going to get up there to get this at this point. This has been an interesting round. My ankles. My ankles. How about that? I got to give them the salute. I did better than I thought I did. <laughs> I felt like I died a lot, but only six times. How about that? So there you go. Third person versus first person. I prefer first person. It's a lot easier to judge your swings in my opinion in this game. But hey, now you know how to do it. Now you know the pros and cons. Have fun. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, stay healthy. Catch y'all next time.